Do you guys want to see my floors? Wow. Does anyone else have a million TikTok dances in their head at all times? Good morning. I'm starving. This is how I start every vlog now. I have more good news. But first, since you know, we haven't been living in our house really for four months, we have no food. Let me just show you. We have creamer, dog food, pickles, leftovers, condiments, and mixed cheeses. That's really all we have. And I don't even like oatmeal, but I ran out of flour bars and that's really the only thing that I eat. You girls gotta eat, otherwise I'm gonna freak out. I don't even know how to make it. I just found this random Quaker instant oatmeal banana nut. Last week, the workers came and they finished our floors, but it's still not done. Mix. Is it supposed to be watery like this? Someone who likes oatmeal, tell me. Is it supposed to look like that? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. They still have to come to put in the baseboards and paint, finish painting the garage and painting the bathroom vanity. Last weekend, we got all of our stuff from the tiny house that we've been staying in for the past few months and took it here. Some footage of that. Got the car all packed. We're moving back home. Finally, after four months. We're about to see our floors for the very first time. Would you like to open the door? Yeah. Wow. It looks good. Yeah. It looks way better than the old ones. It looks very natural. Oh my gosh. Well, yeah, Does it? The only thing is this trim. Oh, that's not the right trim. That is a very different color. They used it on all of the, uh, all of us, those points. They did? That is not the right color at all. Look. <laughs> oh my gosh, how crazy. It's nice. Four months later. It flows so well with the upstairs. We brought it all back so my house is filled with crap. So we have floors after four months. Our house is a mess, but I mean, y'all know. We have floors again. We had someone come and mount the TV yesterday because they ha we had to take down everything off the walls. So if we mounted it back, this transition piece is literally not even close to like the color of the floors. So they're fixing that. But other than that, we have floors, you guys. I'm just like, I told Trey last night, like I'm just so happy <laughs> because like it just made me, one, remember that I love our house. Immediately just made me feel like, like a weight has been lifted off my shoulders because I just could not function in this house. Like I just couldn't do it. Um, hi, I'm starving again. Does anyone else have a million TikTok dances in their head at all times? Also, let's talk about these Starbursts, okay? Ladies and gentlemen, I saw these Starbursts at Walmart and I had to try them. Never had these flavored Starbursts before. I'm a big Starburst fan. That was always my candy that I would get when I was a kid. Starburst, my dad would always get me like the Starburst, Starburst like, like little like, like little stick things. I had like a bunch of them in it. Starburst are my jam. I haven't had them in a long time. I saw this and I was like, <sighs> I'm not kidding when I say it. This is busting. I am an advocate for healthy eating. I am so passionate about that stuff. I could talk to you about that for hours. Listen, there's a few things I am so passionate about that are so bad for you. And that would be Taco Bell, like uh, gummy bears, like that era, that genre of candy my fave. I'm not a Skittles fan, I will say that. I do not like Skittles, but like gummy bears, gummy worms, Starburst, watermelon, Sour Patch Kids. But sometimes you just gotta live a little. All about balance. This is, this is what happens. I can't, I can't stop. Once I start, I will eat the whole bag. Mm, 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 m
makeshift tripod. I'm at my parents' tiny house today. Trey is not with me, he is at the house with the construction workers. They are putting up our baseboards today and hopefully painting the rest of the garage. I made myself a little pineapple protein smoothie. <sighs> I'm just ready to like not be living in two different places. Like I would love to just have it be done and like organize the house because we're having cleaners come next week to like do a full deep clean of the house and we haven't been home to literally clean or do anything there for four months so cheers to a good day i hope you guys are having a good day i will keep you guys updated can you believe it we made it i have floors how we got here i couldn't tell you four months later I have floors in my house. Trey's like, I feel like you're just so happy. So much less stressed out and just like overall just more happy. And I just like told Trey like, I feel like once our floors are fixed, I'm just gonna be a lot better, happier person. And I just feel like already I'm just so much happier because I feel like I can organize my house and clean it and like get it back together because that's been something I've wanted to do for months. For me, my house is like kind of my sanctuary. I want my house to feel like cozy and homey and it just has felt like a death trap for a while. And I'm just so thrilled to finally have people over. We have not had any of our friends over this year because in January we had COVID and then in February our house flooded and now it is almost July and it'll be like the first time we have people over. I feel like my house just feels like home again. I think that's all for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel if you're not already. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks for coming along this very long journey of us going through all this with our house and just, I'm just glad it's over. I'm so glad it's finally over. <laughs> but love y'all. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.